Welcome everyone to the stream. Uh, today we're playing Red Dead Redemption. We're playing the online version. It's a little bit dark. It's like nighttime here. Very atmospheric. And, um, and uh, I'm going to be playing the online version whenever I stream simply because whenever I try to play the story mode, I can't really follow along with the story and I can't really follow along with the chat either. And then I sort of get a, you know, subpar experience of both. So I thought that Actually, playing the online version would be a much better choice for streaming, so here we are. And uh, yeah, I was having some technical issues there a moment ago, but we seem to have solved them for now. So let's just hope that uh, it keeps working. And yeah, let's, uh, let's go adventuring now. So let me see now. My girly here, she had to go to the post office, so let's just make a waypoint over there. And... Uh, ah bah, t'es français en plus. Vince du 31. Ah, oh, there's like a oh. voice Vince. activated. Allo, allo. Wonder if I should. Uh, let me just check the settings here. Je peux me tirer une balle dans la tête, s'il te plaît. If I can turn, I'm not sure if my own mic is, is uh, hearing whether you can hear that or not, uh, or whether other people can hear that or not. Let me just see voice chat. Let's uh, turn off my mic. There we go. Good. And how can I turn, let's turn this off as well. Because I don't want to be hearing other people chatting in during the stream, do I? Okay. It could be that, <laughs> it could be that actually people could hear, um, could hear me like blabbering there for a moment, which would be pretty hilarious actually. Oh, geez. And actually, where's my horse? Let's just uh, call for my horse. And somehow I seem to be magically... Oh, there comes my horse. Magically transported to this other location. I wasn't here at all when uh, we we logged off last time, so I'm not sure how it teleported me like that. Yes, I have a beautiful black horse called Black Beast. And uh, let's go adventuring with... Uh, I'm not sure, is that a... I'm trying to look, yeah. I can see some... I can see some testes, so it's definitely a stallion now. Uh, and we need to go over... I'm not sure why I can't do a waypoint. I'm trying to do the waypoint. You see that? I press that. And just it just sort of removes it. So I guess we're just going to have to... We're just going to have to like just walk over there then. I'm not sure what's going on. Hmm. And of course see it in the mini map there so not really a need for a waypoint here but yeah i have no idea like whether or not like um i'm assuming other players can kill me if they want just do one adjustment here Seems to be a little orange thingamajig. Somebody's trying to wave me down here. It's like this little. See that little orange icon in the mini map? There's like this. Uh, Hello. This guy, sort of like this icon of somebody waving me down. So there might be some quest or something. Let's have a look. Oh, didn't want that. Still getting used to like how the online version works there. Seems there's slightly different options here. So, what does the does the is there something here for me? Good to see you. Collect deliveries. Okay. Letter from Crips and an invitation to discuss business opportunities. Treasure map, blue water marsh, login, reward unlocked. Okay. Okay, let's let's read the letter to Crips then, or letter. Uh, is it? Hold on. 
Letter from Crips. Let's have a look at that. Oh, can I not... Uh, can I not read that then? I guess I can't. Hmm. Okay. And what was the other thing actually that I got also in the mail? I guess that would be here in the documents section. So treasure maps, a collection of treasure maps open. Blue water marsh. Should we go do that? So there's a treasure map. Okay, so we are, yeah, let's go do that uh, just for the heck of it. So let's make a waypoint to that point, to that area. Good. And now we're actually able to do the waypoint. Not sure why that wasn't working before. It's a bit dark to go out doing a, a treasure map, but uh, but at least we have the beautiful uh, moonlight here. Hello okay. There, ma oh, that was polite, ma'am. just figure out like which camera view I want as well maybe this one we'll try the close one for now yeah. and switch over to the medium one if it uh, just feels a little bit more immersive maybe from this this view as well This game are truly spectacular. I don't think I've played any game with uh, such amazing graphics. I'm trying to actually soothe my horse. Oh, it is working actually. We got a little bit of uh, bonded with our horse a little bit. here. Huh? Well, it's like some kind of m enter takeover series matchmaking. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I think I'll leave that alone for now. Yeah. Sounds scary. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I forgot to actually check out. I forgot to check out that orange marker that we had in the post office earlier on. Not sure what was going on there. Oh, and I have to also do one little change. There we go. Okay. So uh, yeah, I did start the online version and I was able to get put together a relatively okay looking character, uh, even though my first experience that first day that we streamed uh, was a rather negative one. Like I was like, what the heck? All these characters look so damn ugly. But uh, I was able to make a kind of okayish looking character. They're, they're not the prettiest the characters in this game. I'm not sure. I haven't tried making a, a male character for online. I, I, I'm guessing you can't even. I guess you can only make one, right? I'm not. I'm assuming that you can't go and uh, sort of start fresh. I'm not sure. Uh, so what I meant to say is I don't know what the male character is like. Just 
whether or not you can get like you can actually make a really handsome looking male character or not but at least with the film female options there are hardly there are hardly any options to choose from that actually look like decent uh all of the the skins and the the facial features and just the bone structure were like super super raggedy Are we now? Oh, we still have quite a ways to go. Oh well, we might uh, end up in some adventures along the way. Let's see what happens. Horse bonding increased to level two. Nice. My horse de deserves a nice little, nice little pat on neck for that. It's a beautiful horse. I, I got it through one of the missions, actually. And there's a, looks like there's some kind of church over there. I wonder if it's abandoned. There's a house on the right as well. It's so dark right now. I wonder if there's a way to tell the time in the game. And uh, the horse would like some brushing. Do I actually... Oh my gosh, it's so dark, guys. I'm not sure if you guys can see anything, really. I feel like going to investigate. I wish I had some kind of lantern or something. Let me just check my inventory. I'm guessing I don't have one, though. What's that thing? Oh, it's just a tarot card. Um... Materials, ingredients, tonics, provisions, kit. So you have a camera. A camp. Gives you a place to chest to rest in the wilderness. And catalogue. Okay. Yeah, this is clearly an abandoned uh, church. Let's let's go do let's go do let's do a little snoop inside and see if there's anything to loot. Refuses to open up. What about the house over on the other side? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, geez, it's so black, guys. I know you guys can't see anything, but I certainly can't see anything either. Let's see if there's anything here. Oh, so black. We definitely need some kind of lantern, don't we? Search drawer. I wonder if uh, the general store would have one. Oh, you know what, actually? Uh, let's just check. Let's just check the catalog that we have, whether or not they sell catalogs. Where was it again? Tools. Oh, I guess it must be in this. No, here we go. Okay, let me just check whether there's any, like, um... Oh, it's so dark. Even the catalog is dark here, uh, which of course makes sense if she's looking at the book here at night time. Let me see. Hunting and fishing, workwear and trades. Oh, it's so dark. So there's like outfits. Gosh, I can't see anything. We're going to have to look at this later on. I wonder if there's a lantern that you could buy. Now imagine if we were to find a lantern. Now that would be very cool. Nothing there either. Oh, search, hold on. Search drawer. Oh, no, there's nothing there. It's so black can barely see a thing. 
There's nothing to loot. So I'm wondering whether, like, um, if another player were to come to the same place, uh, or, or let's say this, that, like, if somebody would have looted this place, say, an hour ago, and I come to the place, is that an actual player, an NPC? I think that's an NPC. At least it's a little bit lighter outside now. Thank goodness. Couldn't see a thing. So basically I was just wondering whether the loot is sort of player specific and whether it sort of refreshes itself or not. You know, if, if somebody already looted it, does that mean that another player can't loot it for, you know, within that day or within a few hours? Let's see about this house, if there's anything inside. And uh, yeah, guys, let me know if if the volumes and everything are working okay for you guys. If you're hearing, I'm, I'm assuming you're hearing my voice and everything. Because nobody's saying anything in the chat, which is a bit strange, because we had several people before the um, I was running into the technical difficulties with OBS. And so there were several people chatting back then, but now nobody's saying anything, so I'm just worried whether the, the stream is working properly after the adjustments that I made. I'm assuming... Hello, Landon. Okay, everything is good? I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, so just a moment ago we were having major technical difficulties, but when I switched to dir the DirectX... Oh, jeez. Settings in... Uh, in the game, then that solved the issues I was having with OBS. So thankfully we got it to work. I'm so relieved. I was really stressed out about that. Okay, let's see if there's anything to loot here. Ill with sin. Okay, that's... Oh, horsey, horsey, where are you going? Come on over here. Where are you going? Did he get like, uh... Did he get spooked by something? I think he might have gotten spooked by something. Maybe there was a snake or something. Good horsey. Yeah. Yeah. And Jcast, yeah. Oh, you're you're back. Good, good. I'm so happy I got this to work, Jcast. I was, oh, I was so like, oh, look at the beautiful sunlight coming through the, the morning mist, guys. Oh my gosh, how beautiful is that? I'm gonna try the camera. I've never tried that actually. I've never tried the camera, let's see. The camera would have been in the tools, I think. Or where the heck was it? No, materials? There we go, kit. Good morning, miss. This is a, can I actually use this? Okay, it's grayed out. Maybe I just don't have a camera then. I'm not sure, I thought I got a camera. Maybe it, uh, maybe I have to get off my horse for it to work. Because there's like, it's kind of like a different inventory, but it kind of isn't. I don't know, it's kind of kind of confuses me sometimes. See? So now the camera's actually white. Okay, let's see. I've never tried the camera yet, so let's see. Handheld. Look at that beautiful morning mist. And uh, Okay, so you can do a selfie as well. Self-portrait. I would have preferred to have her sort of basking in that. Let's go into the sunlight, see if we can get her right into the sunlight. There we go. Man, her eyes are pretty light. She looks so harsh. Let's see. Expression? Okay, you can change the exp Oh, you can change the expression. That's pretty cool. Uh, pose? Hmm. 
Okay. Uh, and... Oh, she can't move around. Okay, let's just take some kind of picture here. I'm nervous that somebody's gonna come and rob me if I just stand there too long. F6 is for camera, F6 is for screenshots. Oh, so I don't have to go into the inventory. Let's uh, actually just make sure she has her, her rifle instead. And then if I try F6, nothing happens. So maybe, I don't know, maybe she has to be farther away from the horse when I do that. Let's try again. F6. Nothing happens. Oh, well, I'll have to look into that later. Okay. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Look at this gorgeous morning. It's so pretty, this game. I mean, just look at the vegetation, guys, like how naturally it... Uh, you know, all the little bushes and trees and everything looks unique. Nothing looks like a cookie cutter, you know. And I'm sure there must be duplicates of the trees, but you would never notice it. Oh, I'm actually going in the wrong direction now. We need to be going this direction for the treasure map. swampy area. I haven't seen a swampy area yet in this game. Hmm. I wonder if I wonder if there's things like quicksand and like wonder if it's possible to actually get stuck in the mud so that your horse would start like actually I'm not gonna try it but that your horse would actually start sinking into the mud. That makes me nervous a little bit. Might be wisest, wisest to just stay on the on the road here. Hello, welcome back, Devil. Yes, I got it working. So, so the way that I changed it. Uh, thank you so much for the follow, Antler Moss. Welcome to the stream. So that the way I got it, uh, the way I changed it, or like got it to work, uh, Devil was. I changed, I, I found a discussion online and the, somebody was having the exact same problem and the solution to that was to um, change the graphical settings. Hold on, what was that? You just paid your daily stable upkeep fee. And it was changing the graphic settings in the game to direct X um, instead of Vulcan. And uh, that seemed to solve the issue. Oh, hold on. This way we need to go. Yeah, I feel much better actually about playing the online version here on stream because I feel... I don't feel like I'm um, ruining the, the story for myself, you know? And then I can like freely make pauses uh, and uh, follow what you guys are saying. And oh, we're actually in the right area, guys, now. So, so we have to go right in the middle. Now, I wonder, am I able to just walk into this water? Or am I going to start sinking down? I'm a bit nervous about this. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, 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 no. Poor horsey. <gasps> Oh, no, 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 no. We definitely... I wonder if you can go swimming with the horse into the water. My horse didn't like that at all. My horse didn't like that one one single bit. So we have to get... I guess we have to get to that house, right? So we're going to have to circle around this, like, a water area then, I guess. Hmm. Oh, gosh. Look how it's getting really... 
muddy guys. Like my horse is actually struggling to walk in this this stuff. Jeez. I I just bet you can sink into like quicksand or like into mud in this game. I just betcha. And that's like one way to die in the game. So let's just circle around and see if we can w make it somehow to that house. Yeah, you do get, uh, oh jeez, no, 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 horsey, no, no, oh Jesus, no, 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 no. Okay, let me just take care of that uh, alligator first thing. Oh, horsey, come on, it's okay, it's okay. No need to worry, I took care of that mean old crocodile. We're fine. You just you just calm your nerves there. Let's, let's just pat him a little bit. That's fine, horsey. It's fine. Yeah, Landon. Uh, like right now, we're on a quest actually to uh, to go and do a treasure a treasure map. And I just need to find a way to get to that place because it's like this ho house in the middle of that swampy area over there. Uh, I don't want to... Now I'm definitely glad I didn't go deeper into the water because there's actually crocodiles in there. Is my horse like... Uh, is my horse actually injured? And he seems to be actually sweating as well from underneath the... Underneath the saddle. You see that white stuff close to the saddle? That's like... Horse... That's what it looks like when a horse sweats actually. So I wish I could... I don't know if I have a brush or not. Let me just try that quickly. Um, pat, fleet, and okay. Feed, I could at least feed the horse a bit. See how that uh, character glitched out a bit there? Weird. Huh. What's with that meter at the bottom? That looked worrying a bit. Yeah, I did, I, it seems I don't have a horse brush though. So I'm gonna have to find a horse brush from some place. There's another crocodile over there. Jeez. Ugh. Yuck. But I'm glad I didn't go deeper into the water then because uh, there would have been crocodiles and they would have eaten us for dinner. So we need to get to that house over there. And uh, Landon, uh, continuing on the quest question, then there's also like um, tasks to uh, to actually do like tasks for NPCs. Ugh, that's an actual player. sound. No, let me look at this map now. No, 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 no. Okay, so we actually should go through here. Okay, so so this is an actual town now then. Huh. Hey. Are these houses abandoned? Let me just look at the map. So there's a... Oh, there's, is that like a quest giver over there? Let me just go check that out quickly. So there's another one of those orange thingies. and you ain't here for no crawfish. <laughs> Which means you heard I might have some work. I ain't gonna ask no questions about you between the gators and other unsavory characters about. Me and mine, well, 
We can use all the help we can get. I don't know how we ended up here. But here's where we are. This is home. Now, you can't be no fisherman without no boat. Now, can you? There's some mean old fellas up at Macomb's Inn. They got mine. And they ain't gonna give it back to me neither. You collect it, I'd be obliged. It's just down the Kamasa. Real obliged. I swear. Hmm. So there we go. We got a quest from an NPC. Okay. Come on, horsey. Now, before we go do... Oh, should, maybe we should go do this. Yeah, well, let's go do this. Just don't want that quest to actually, like, time out, you know? Let's see how qu close by that is. So, it's all the way down there. Well, it's not too far off. Yeah, let's go do that. I'm clearly getting sidetracked now. to Macomb's end. I like how the NPCs like uh, greet you when you come across them. At least that's one way to know that uh, whether or not it's like an NPC or an actual player because most likely the players are not going to be doing that, right? get my gun ready. You never know. Look at those beautiful trees. Oh my goodness. Amazing trees. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna crouch down from this point because I have no idea what the hell that is gonna go on, whether I'm in danger or not. You hear that mosquito buzzing by? I can imagine a place like this would have just billions and oh. That went pretty well. Retrieve the boat. So how the heck do I get onto the boat? Oh, you just uh, do that, okay. Um, and now what? Uh, hmm, so I'm on the boat now, but how in the heck do I get it to how do I get it to go? 
Do you know what? Uh, does anyone know here in the chat? Like, how can I get this... This boat to actually go? So it has oars. It doesn't... Of course, there wouldn't have been an engine in this time. Do I have to sit down over here? No. I don't get it. When I, uh... <coughs> Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have to Google this very quickly. Let's see. How to ride boat. Red Dead Redemption 2. And Landon doesn't know. Thank you for the follow. Craig, love, welcome to the stream. How do you use a boat? So I hold down the triangle button there, and I'm in the canoe. Now to paddle, and nothing's working. You're like, I, I'd like to use this boat. It's just sitting there, but is it just a prop, or can I actually use it? Well, the good news is there is a way to use it. If you remember uh, in the GTA 5 game uh, for the PS4, there was this triangle button you used to get into a car. Uh, mm. There's also the triangle button you used to get on the horse. And as you can. Oh, well. What about E? Okay, E seemed to work. Good. Oof. So just like getting on a horse then. Okay. Now we need to go this way, yes. Slow going, my goodness. And hello, Darkish, and hello, Crib42. Welcome, guys. Yeah, I've had to do that as well, Darkish, to check the, the key binds. Actually, you know what I did? I, um, I actually took screenshots of all the key binds for myself so I wouldn't have to actually look at them in the game and sort of interrupt the game. Uh, and I should have actually done that. I completely forgot I did that, actually. Okay. Well, the main thing is we figured it out. So apparently getting on wagons and boats and horses, it's all the same. Oh, jeez. Is there like a crocodile here close by? Sounds ominous. I should have actually checked those houses to see if there was anything I could loot there. Ooh. Crikey. I wonder... Oh, I'm not s oh, there's a snake at least. Let me just check the map here to see uh, the geometry of the... Okay, so I have to go definitely that way. Around this little peninsula here. Man, she's going so slow. I wonder if there's a way for me to actually speed up. Rival players can attack the boat. Oh no. Oh yeah, I've heard that like uh, players can uh, steal your quests actually. So Curb, what was the solution to making the game work? Um, so, um, so do you mean like uh, the troubles that I was having um, when it first launched or do you mean like in today's stream? So to get the game to, to work in general, um, they, Rockstar was, uh, was releasing patches pretty much every day after their launch. And then finally the patch that they released like three days later, or was it four days later on Saturday, um, for AMD CPUs, that one did it for me. Then it finally worked, and it's worked flawlessly ever since. Today, however, we were having a different issue, and that was with OBS. OBS was not really dealing very well with uh, the game for some reason, and when I changed the settings in, um, in Red Dead Redemption to use DirectX 
instead of Vulcan in the graphics settings, then it, then OBS uh, wanted to work with the game. I'm not sure why I didn't have those issues on Saturday, because uh, the, the, the stream went just fine on Saturday. I'm not sure. Um, but main thing is that it's working now. Yay, we got this finished. Nice. And my horsey, oh, my horsey has automatically come back to me. Good, 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 good. Wild animal kills challenge. Hold F1 to view invite. Let's see what this is. Hold F1. Okay, or I guess I already missed it. Oh, look how beautiful it is, guys. So atmospheric. Yes, Curb, exactly. I'm glad. Uh, the only problem is that the the settings to make a female character, like, really, really... There were not very many choices if you wanted to make, like, an attractive, like, female character. They were all looking really, really crummy, actually. I'm not sure if it's the same issue with making a male character or how easy it is to make a, you know, decent-looking male character uh, in the game. Actually, I want to... I'm just wondering now whether or not... So what's this thing over here? And I, I, oh, did I miss my, uh, I wonder, now that I went to do that thing, okay, let's look if I still have my treasure map, because we were in the middle of actually doing my treasure map, um, and then we got distracted by this quest. So let's see if the treasure map is actually still there. Yes, treasure map. Okay, now we can sort of, I guess we can reactivate it now. Yes, okay, good, good, good. And we're very close by. We're just over here. So we'll just turn out, turn down, uh, turn around, I should say. And we'll go along this pin. Oh gosh, how to get there? I guess this would be the f best way, because we, we came on this side, but it seemed like it would be impossible to get there. So let's try it through this route instead. Okay. Oh, the game is so pretty. So pretty. Um, I'll just make the waypoint. So I can sort of figure it out easier what direction to go into. Okay, so we need to f turn around. Yeah, Curb, I, I do believe that in Red Dead Redemption 1, when you had the online version there, I think there was also a female option. Uh, but it, uh, like in the story mode, neither of them have a female option, I'm afraid. And also in... Uh, tackle sold here. And also in GTA 5, you can also make a female character there as well, in the online version. So Dorkish, uh, oh, there's a crocodile. Oh, no, 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 don't, no, 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 horsey. Don't get too nervous. So there is a croc, we're gonna have to kill it, I guess, to be able to go forward. Oh, geez, there's like crocs all over the damn place. Ugh. Okay, horsey. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Uh, let me just make sure I take care of those crocs first. Should probably get a rifle. Do I have a rifle with me? No. Oh, here, here we go. Yes, okay. Okay, at least I scared that one off. My horse is not enjoying this whatsoever. Oh, my horse is so nervous. Well, I would be too. And there's a croc over there. Jeez. 
I wonder if going to get this treasure is just the worst idea ever. Now it's getting dark as well. I'll get to the chat any second now. We're kind of in a dangerous situation right now, though. I'm gonna have to fuck. I can hardly see anything, guys. <sighs> I wonder if there's some crocs here. Let's go very slowly. Oh, jeez. Now it's getting deep. I wonder how deep I can go with this horse. Oh shit. Well, there goes my horse. Come on, horsey. It's fine. No. Come on, horsey. That was a crocodile sound right there. My horse is... I, well, I, I, any horse would be spooked in this situation, right? Come on, horsey. You can get over here. Come on. There's a whole bunch of crocs here. Gosh. Okay, so there's the house that we need to get to at least. Maybe I'll just ignore the horse for now. And maybe I'll just try and make it over there. I'll just shoot the water and try and make it over there. I wonder if you can drown in this game. Oh jeez, now we got attacked. Shit. Oh no. Go, 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 go. Oh. Crikey. Oh. My horse is running around. Who's that over there? So that's a red, so that surely must be... I'm not sure, like... <coughs> if you get the red dot, is that automatically a, a bad guy? I'm not sure who that is over there, it's... Go, 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 go. Oof. Okay, are there any people here? Now, are we at the map spot? Or did I completely... Go there goes my poor horse. So we're not even at the map spot. All of that for nothing. Jeez. Oh no. My poor horse. My poor horse is so stressed out. Come on, horsey. Poor horsey. Come on, horsey. Come on. I wonder if the crocodiles would actually eat my mount. <sighs> so, <laughs> what is this place then? If this was not the, the treasure map place, let's go and have a little look and see what this is. Is this like, like somebody living here or what the heck?
So, Dork, as you were saying that you downloaded the game when it first released on an AMD processor, but after nine hours, one of their patches that day and after downloading the latest video driver, you had no problems getting it to run. Yeah. And Dorcas, you're still stuck in the snow part of the game and you should play it a bit more today. <laughs> like a Florida golf course. Curb, uh, in this day and age, you're just happy to be able to choose the gender. Uh, all the sex, the, you know, the sex sexism and stuff. They're good games that j don't rely on an attractive main female character to be a strong woman. Yeah, I like. Don't get me wrong. I absolutely appreciate the fact that there are like that you can choose like an ugly or an old character as well. That you're not just forced to you know choose like a a big boobed bimbo. Uh, absolutely. Uh, I just I just feel that there should have been also a few more variations for being able to um, choose like an attractive char character if you wanted to. And it seemed very limited. So I wonder. Um, one sec. Okay. So let's see what's inside up here. It's like somebody living here actively, apparently so, since like the candle is on and uh, I wonder if I could take that, oh hold on, take assorted biscuits, yes please. I wonder if I could take that lantern, because having a lantern would just help so much. Uh, search drawers, no it doesn't let me take the lantern. Of, of, of course the bad side about having a lantern is then it would... Uh, it would attract attract attention from players, right? They could see me better in the dark, which I guess wouldn't be such a good thing. Open, what do we have in here? Some biscuits, baked beans. And what do we have over here? Some booze. Moonshine. Okay. Okay. So, look how beautiful the game looks, guys. Now, can I not take that lantern with me? Man, I would really want one, actually. Nope. There's a rat running around as well. I wonder if you could make rat stew in this game. Oh, look how pretty it is, guys. Jeez. Hello, Vertissi. Welcome to the stream. Uh, and, uh, Vertissi, do I have a low bitrate? The stream becomes pixelated when I move around, move my camera around. Oh, does it? And for you, it looks fine, Curb. Aha. Uh -huh. Hmm. So the bit rate that I have right now in OBS is, um, let me just check. I have a sort of like a middle ground bit rate because when I had a higher one, uh, it would become very, very buffered for people. And then the lower one is... So my video bit rate right now, right now is 2,500. Um, so I'm not sure if that's too low. So what do you guys, do you guys have a recommendation for a bit rate uh, for playing this game? I wonder if it would help. It would require me to actually restart the stream though because um, uh, the setting is something you can only set when uh, when you're not live, so... But you're not seeing any issue like that, uh... Curb? What about the rest of you? Hmm. 
I'm just wondering to myself now, because... Oh, she's actually getting tired. And it, okay, but... Yeah, so guys, uh, it looks okay when you're standing still. Like, I know exactly what Vertesi is talking about, though, because I was capturing some video footage of World of Warcraft, and I noticed that same issue, that it got really pixelated when I was moving around, and when I was standing still, it was fine. So, so guys, pay attention. For those of you who, f for whom it's fine, let's just pay attention for a moment if I just move around a lot. Does it come really... Does it get really, like, pixelated for you when I'm running around like this? Or is it still sharp? Because that's the, that's the actual test here. And Curb, there's no pixelation for you even when I'm running? And Curb, are you watching? Uh, are you watching on? What kind of device are you watching on? Oh, so you did see something, Curb? Hold on. Let's do some running a little bit. Gonna have to try and find that map now. Okay, so so we need to. Let's go over here. Let's make a waypoint. So the pit, the bit rate I am at is. Two thousand five hundred. So, what bit rate would you guys recommend? I could, I mean, because I'm not going to be like uh, putting this stream up on YouTube or anything, so it doesn't matter if we restart the stream. I could do like an experiment because it would be nice if the game looked nice for you guys. So, what bit rate would you guys recommend? I mean, I think the default when I installed OBS was actually 6,000. Uh, maybe if I try 4,500, like a mid-range between 3,000 and 6,000. I'm going to try that, guys, and I'll restart the stream. Let's see what happens. 